Pittsburgh Theological Seminary challenges people, I think, because it invites people to live in a community with, other, with others, with people who are different than that they are. And, and that is not a negative thing, that is a positive thing. It is positive to be living with people with other, who are different than you are because that is what ministry is going to look like. And you will be ministering in a context that has a, that has a great variety and diversity to it. And so you're, you're already invited to, to, to prepare yourself for that by living with, by being confronted directly with people who are, who are different. Um, so this is a place where on the one hand you're invited to live into the community that has rooted you, that has formed you, that has made you the kind of person who you are. And at the same time, it invites you to live with people who come from different traditions. And, and those different traditions, they are here on campus, not just in the classroom as that they are being taught about them, but they are present in living people. And so we have, even though this is a Presbyterian institution, we have the Lutheran bishop who comes around regularly, we have the Episcopal bishop here who has an office on campus, we have Baptist ministers who are involved in chapel and in the classroom. And so that means that not just people um, who belong to the communities represented by these leaders are there by bedding, are getting um, apprenticed to these communities, but also others. Um, suddenly, as a Baptist, you see an, a man walking around in a collar and a purple shirt. And you're asking yourself, so what does that mean? And what does it mean for me? And how do I re relate to that? And you build a relationship. And suddenly, this other becomes somebody who's familiar to you and that changes you and it will change the way that you will be doing ministry in the future. I, I think really at the core of this institution right now is a desire to combine two things that often um, fall apart in theological education. What we are trying to do is to hold those two things, on the one hand of being deeply rooted in classical disciplines, in deep study, to hold that together with this entrepreneurial approach and let those two be integrated and let those two be informed. So those are not sitting side by side here. But if you're here, we try to invite you into a holistic approach, preparing yourself for those kind of ministries that you may not imagine yourself doing yet, but that God will be putting on your way.